Yeah, welcome back to Gear Guitars with Mel. I am Mel. Uh, this is going to be the new staging area for what we're doing for the moment. Uh, it's tough to do it in the house, you know. Got a big family. Uh, I'm very easily distracted, which is why you get, I don't know, a year before I do another video sometimes. But uh, no, here to talk about the classic vibe 1970s Stratocaster. This guitar is awesome. Not going to lie. Um, is it perfection, as Chandler would say? No, not so much, but it's damn good. So you're looking at your average Strat accoutrement, you know what I mean? You got a poplar body, um, and I'm assuming they went poplar for the naturals, or maybe for the 70s just in general, because uh, I don't know what all the colors are, but this one's got some really nice, you know, ash looking grain, you know, on it, so it's all pretty in the natural. Got a tortoiseshell pickup. We got Fender design pickups this time around. Uh, rock maple neck with some pretty decent flaming in it, actually. I'm, I'm kind of cool with that. And as usual, the uh, veneer Fender pickup uh, fingerboard. Yeah, I'm okay. Um, thing about the fingerboard is it is not rosewood as you would get used to. This is Indian laurel, which I'm okay with. And uh, heads up. I think it was Mike Shepard that had mentioned in the comments of the last video I'd have to get in depth about the damage. And there was no damage. Uh, I'm a jack, but it was just glue. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe they glued... No, maybe. They glued the, uh, the nuts in. And if it wasn't that, then I couldn't tell you. But it was just some kind of adhesive came right off. So, no big deal. Uh, where was I? So, yeah. C, you know, C-shape profile. Um, like you're going to get on your general strats. 25 and a half inch scale, nine and a half inch radius. Uh, good guitar. It comes with a bone nut from the factory, which is again, pretty cool. Vintage style saddles, stamped squire. They got the uh, aged white for the white parts. Uh, and this is actually a two piece body, which I'm pretty stoked on. Uh, it's a strat, right? So let's see if it sounds like a strat. We'll do some tones, start off in the bridge. And I'll give you my clean tone, which I'm running through always on EP Booster, uh, SP Compressor, both from Exotic, and uh, Kayleen or Kayline Snake Bite Reverb because it's awesome. We'll get to that. We're gonna have a video on that one. All right, so yeah, single coils. I do have to point out is that the net uh, the nut is cut a little high um, I gotta say it's it's a little high so that when you when you really pinch down because it's got these medium tall frets now the uh, classic vibes just like a lot of the regular fenders so win for us um, but yeah they're they're pretty high so they you know Consider it like a medium jumbo fret, but skinny, right? So uh, what happens is because the nuts cut that high, you can you, you can go sharp on all the notes. But you know what? At three ninety nine, and it came to my door in tune, for the most part ready to rock, though missing my trim bar. They decided I deserve one. No, I'm just kidding. I talked to Chris up at Sweetwater. Thank you, by the way, bro. He's uh, hooking me up, sending me one. It's already on the way. And he's the one that uh, did this little deal with me on this. He's a great dude. You should check him out. But back to the toes. Now we're going to go second position, which is, you know, the quickity quack in the middle. Right here on the middle and the uh, bridge pickup. <laughs> Fourth position. 
neck and middle. Let's uh, go with just a little bit of breakup. Not bad. Not bad. I, I these pickups are clear. I dropped them. Dropped them down there, you know, um, because when I did plug it in, first thing, they they were really high to the strings. And it just, you lost all that stratty goodness. Uh, this is a clone clone, just so you know what kind of uh, circuit I'm breaking it up with. to something that's a little tube screamer. -ish. That was, uh, man, that's courtesy of my Kayleen, uh, crazy cacti that I got. That thing is a, is a beast, I tell you what. Let's go with a uh, higher gain. find in the range of pretty weirdness. Do you know what pretty weirdness is? talking about 399 to your door uh, you can get one used on reverb for probably around 350 this is a is a beast I man 
I'm really stoked this got sent to me and and I love it and I'm going to hug it until I sound like Stevie Ray Vaughan. <laughs> so I got some more videos coming up. I know it's been a while, but bought a house, things going on, you know what I mean? Um, coming up, we're gonna do some videos on guitars that you guys have seen on this channel before, but they are just not the same. Um, one, especially being Missouri, my, uh, oh, this bad girl here, but uh, let's not steal the thunder of this amazing kick butt. Classic Vibe Strat. I am very stoked to have this in my possession and it doesn't hurt. I mean, look at those two together. Classic Vibe's just killing it, man, killing it. Um, so again, thanks to Chris up at Sweetwater. You are the man. Uh, and I've got some videos for you guys, man. We're gonna be doing a lot of pedal videos um, because I went ham on my pedal board and it took a while, but I finally got there, so. That's gonna be good stuff. But thanks for tuning in, checking out. Like, share, subscribe, tell your friends. Hit me in the comment section. Let me know what you guys are looking for for content and I'll see if I can do it. Remember, uh, I'm a budget gear dude because family and poor. <laughs> All right, guys.